Hey guys, welcome to another plugin tutorial and today it's on Char's API. So this is a fantastic plugin which allows you to create floating text in the sky using different fonts, different sizes and different colours. And as you saw there, different animations as well. So let's go ahead and just show you how it works. So if you use CH build, followed by some text, this will create the default white text in the sky. So I set the font as Baybass. There is so many to choose from, which you can see by doing CH list and then the number, and there's so many here. So that's pretty awesome. Um, then you are probably wondering how to change the color. So that's pretty straightforward. If you do CH build using color codes, uh, such as and A, which is uh, light green, or and four, which is um, dark red, hit enter and it will change the color which is really really cool. Um, one cool thing I noticed is if you use and C which is usually uh, light red it's actually brown uh, which is really really nice that you can get brown text as well like that. So if you want to get rid of them you don't like them they're in the wrong place you can do ch clear and then their ID number which you can see in chat or all of them and they will just disappear so the next thing is the font, so if you do chf this will show you information about how to change the font. So if we do ch font, the size, which is going to be 10, uh, any smaller than that and you might not be able to read it and the letters might mess up, so the bigger the better really. Uh, the type, so there's normal, bold or italic, so we're going to go with normal um, and then the font. So as you can see there's so many to choose from and you can even put new ones in the font folder. Um, I believe there is a Minecraft one, so we're going to try that, and then we're going to uh, use some text to build it. Um, so let me test something, and it should look different. Yes, it does. That looks pretty cool. And obviously, if you use capitals, um, that will work as well, uh, which is amazing. This plugin is really, really cool. So. The last thing um, I want to show you before we get onto the animations is how to uh, create a new line. So if you do backslash n, I can't actually get the backslash on my keyboard, which is a bit annoying, it's a shortened version, so I have to copy it from a website on Google. Backslash n and then some more text, um, and it should be on two different lines, uh, which is really, really cool. Obviously if we do CH clear, we can get rid of it. Now earlier I used um, this command uh, with some really complicated letters and pound signs uh, to create the animation. So if we do CHA um, A in, we can see all of the different types of animations we can use. So if you do the at symbol followed by whatever animation you want, let's go with randomize, this one's quite fun. Pound sign G means glass. Uh, you could use W for wool or C for clay and then obviously the color so let's go with uh, 4 red and if we turn around we can see that random blocks are coming in and it should say um, Charles API and we can see it's starting to resemble Charles API and there we go looks very very nice so let's uh, try another one uh, I wonder what other ones we could choose um, by colors maybe not Let's try snake. I haven't tried that one yet, so it might be interesting. And uh, as you can see, it's going along and round. That one's really nice. Very, very cool. I like that one. Um, and I was using a pretty cool one earlier. I can't remember which one it was. I think it might have been um, it's G. Let's have a look at this one. So this one, it just falls down and creates the text. So yeah, that's the plugin. Um, very, very cool. You can download it for free. Subscribe, like, comment, and I'll see you next time.